With the berry pots, you can grow any berry from any region with no worries. That's right, I'll give you some berries too. Berry pots won't do any good without berries, duh. And she uses some orange berries and some pika berries. Orange berries heal 10 HP of your Pokemon and pika berries heal poison. So they're pretty helpful. You have to plant berries in the soil. You should water them from time to time. They, Then they'll grow strong. I have to go back to Goldenrod. Are you heading to Ekerty? Then you should go north here. See you around. Okay, so yeah. Anyway, guys. Dang it. Chrissy. Chrissy interrupted. I was just going to redo the... Yeah, I'll just... I'll shut up. Now I'll say it. Hey guys, welcome back to more Pokemon Soul Silver. In the last episode, we uh, beat Whitney, the Goldenrod City Gym Leader. In this episode, we're going to be heading to Ekertik City. As you probably figured out. I I was checking something there. Sorry. Um. So yeah, here we are on Route 37. On Route 37. Seven, you can find Growlithe only in Heart Gold. Hoot Hoot, Ladybug, Pidgeotto, Pidgey, Spinarat in Heart Gold, Stanler, and Vulpix in Soul Silver. And for Headbutt, you can find e Execute, Hoot Hoot, Ladybug in Soul Silver, Pineco, and Spinarat in Heart Gold. Anyway, so yeah, that's pretty much it. So yeah, let's continue on. Anyway, there's some trainers in this route. There's some twins and some other stuff. These twins, if I remember, they, uh, they, uh, have some grass types. So, yeah, you might want to just set up a team with mate, flying type and fire type like I did. I have, uh, Cyndaquil, or, yeah, Cyndaquil, wow. I'm sorry, Kalava, I so humiliated you there. I'm so sorry. But anyway, twins Tori and Till have a Mareep and a Meryl. I was way off. Okay, so after the battle, um, yeah, look at that. Another double battle. Oh, interesting. Oh, you are a cute little trainer. Why don't you battle me? How about I battle the other girl? The other girl's prettier. Hey, hey there. You young trainer, won't you battle with me? Yeah, I'll battle with you. I won't battle with the other girl. Okay, I guess I will. Beauty K Kaylee and Beauty K Cassandra. Anyway, they both are... They have a Clefable level 16 and a Wigglytuff level 16. And they also have another Pokemon. Each of them have another Pokemon too, so yeah. Anyway, she also has another Clefable level 16. Well, they do, I should say more or less. Anyway, their other Pokemon is another Wigglytuff level 16. Anyway, for that, like, taking forever... <laughs> Sorry, say, oh my... For that, like, taking forever, it's... I'm just, like, gonna freak out. Anyway, over here we can find three apricorn trees. In this apricorn tree, there is a red apricorn. Then to this, in this one is a blue apricorn. Down at the bottom is this apricorn. Wonder what it is. It's a black apricorn. Anyway, um, also down the route here is another trainer. It's a psychic trainer. That means they. <coughs> Sorry, they use psychic Pokemon there. <coughs> Dang it, why am I coughing now so much? Just say, let's see if I can sneak past them. Okay, so... Uh... I think I'm just gonna save that trainer for, you know... Uh... You no, know, uh, free... or er, Off-screen training, you know? I'll just keep him for that, really. That psychic trainer. Can we make it? Yes. So, yes. Welcome to Ekertik City. So awesome. I love the music. I'm going to rehearse at the dance theater. Care to join me? Nah. 
Yeah, I'm gonna pass and I'm gonna heal my Pokemon first. Anyway, um, when you walk inside the Pokemon Center, hi, I'm Bill and and who are you? Wes, hmm. You know what? I'm the one who developed the system to transfer Pokemon. But it couldn't have been done by me alone. For example, do you know the know the Hoenn region? This girl, Net from Hoenn, Hoenn made the Pokemon storage system easier to use. My friends all over the world are working together to improve the Pokemon trade and storage systems. I have to hurry on back to Goldenrod and see my folks. Buh bye. Anyway, um, if you go and visit Bill at his house back in Goldenrod City, he'll give you an Eevee. Now, Eevee's pretty cool. It has its five different evolutions it can go to. You know. Anyway, so yeah, here's the Ecrity Theater. Let's see what this guy has to say. Hmm, I thought I just heard a woman screaming or something. Is that just me? <laughs> nice. Anyway, we're just gonna get into the theater. Hey, hey! Oh no, it's Team Rocket. Stop dancing such a serious dance. Show me something like a hula dance. <coughs> you mustn't push such a request on me. Huh, are you telling me... You don't respect what the customer wants? Well then, I'll show you how to dance. I will, I'll show you a great one. Waha! Oh my god, disturbing. So he's like spinning around. Weirdness. <laughs> yeah, I kind of said the same thing. I'm just like... You know? Hiya. Huh? Who are you? You dare to get my way? Yes, I do. So, yeah. Anyway, Team Rocket Grunt has one Pokemon. It's, it's a coffin. Level 12. Yeah, wow. Okay, so that was way too easy. This is like, I lost. Looks like it. Oh, no. You made me, made me look like a villain. Oops, I have an important mission. If they find out I was wasting time here, they'll make me start all over at, as the lowest Team Rocket Grunt. I better leave now. Yeah, you better. You're just afraid. Anyway, so we walk away. Wonderful, you were just as courageous for your age. Er, yeah. It was a rare sight to see. I want you to have this. Don't be shy. Take it. And he uses HM3, which is surf, and it helps us surf across the waters. <coughs> we can't use it yet until we, uh, beat the gym leader in this town. Then we can use it now. Anyway, so also, uh, on to the, or er, left, or er, er, left, left, or er, western, I'll just say western side of town. There is this guy in this house. Ah, uh, you're on an adventure with your Pokemon. Well... What's an adventure without a tre or treasure hunting? Am I right or, or am I right? Yes, you're right. Good. You understand the true spirit of an adventure. I like that. Take this with you. He gives us the drowsing MC HN, which is the drowsing machine, which helps us find items on the ground. Now, the drowsing machine in this game is a lot better than in the old gold, <coughs> gold crystal and silver, you know. Because this is why, I'll show you in a sec here. Okay, so you, it's obvious, it's on the bottom of the screen here. See, there's this, and you can spin it around. And the brighter, if it gets yellow, that means there's an item near. It'll actually show you where exactly it's at. See there, see it's getting yellow there. See that dot? That's where it's at. It's like... Okay, it's one up and then over. Right there it is. It's a hyper potion. So yeah, that's pretty cool, in my opinion. But anyway, you can just exit out of it if you want. Okay, so yeah, enough looking around in town. Let's go to the gym. I've been anticipating this battle for a while now. You have business with the gym leader? Morty the gym leader has gone to burnt or burnt or burned. Power. Sorry. 
but you have to go ho ho ho. Such a meanie, he pushed me. So I guess we can't go inside, so I guess we're gonna head to the burnt tower. The burnt tower. It was destroyed by a mysterious fire. Please stay away, it is unsafe. You know what? Screw you, son, I'm going inside. <laughs>